A traffic accident occurred near the Polatli district of Ankara when a passenger bus got stuck in the foot of a bridge. The accident occurred on the Ankara Eskizhir road in the Olukpanar village area. The passenger bus went out of control and first crashed into the barriers and then into the overpass wall. While many ambulances and fire crews were dispatched to the scene, the Polatli direction of the road was closed to traffic Ankara Governor Vasip Sahin, who made a statement to CNN TRK regarding the accident, reported that according to initial reports, nine people died and 26 people were injured. He reported that the bus driver was among the dead passengers. Governor Sahin said, there are no brake marks, according to initial assessments, it could be the result of falling asleep. He added that information regarding the real cause of the accident would be shared in the coming hours. Justice Minister Yilmaz Tunk announced that three public prosecutors were assigned to investigate the tragic accident in Ankara. Minister Tunk made the following statement in his message, I wish God's mercy upon our citizens who lost their lives in the bus accident that occurred near the Polatli district of Ankara, patience for their grieving families, and a speedy recovery for our injured citizens. A judicial investigation has been launched by the Ankara West Chief Public Prosecutor's Office regarding the accident that broke our hearts, and three public prosecutors have been assigned under the coordination of a Deputy Chief Public Prosecutor. The investigation is being carried out meticulously. Murat Turkoglu, the driver of the car that was following the bus at the time of the accident, stated that they were going to Polatli and said, we left Tameli together, we were back to front anyway. The bus was a bit fast, it started to wobble 3 to 4 kilometers before here, then it hit the bridge. Parts flying out of the bus hit our vehicle. We flashed our headlights from behind and honked the horn, but he didn't hear us.